All right, Courtney here, onemadhattermom.com. I am... And it's Sarah. Hold on, someone wants to say hi. Come on. And me, Sarah. <laughs> and we're going to try out the umbrella thing at the dirt. It's called an umbrella anchor. An umbrella anchor to put it right over there. And, and because we went back to California, we're going to put it right there. And our helper is dad. Well, he's not done yet at the bathroom. All right. Well, that was a lot you didn't need to know. But she did say some important things. Um, yes, we are going to tell you about this umbrella anchor. Let me show you. Bam, right there. That's the umbrella anchor, right? All right. The umbrella anchor. Can you say, oh. Can you oh, say, uh, oh. Hoo -hoo. Oh, ho, oh, oh. ho. <laughs> That's the company that makes it. Um, they make a variety of products. I've tested a couple of them for them. This one is legit. Okay, so we live in California, yep. like Sarah said, and we like to go to the beach, right, Sarah? All right, so. And we always go to there, and we always buy the Maddie there, right? Right. Well, when we go to the beach, we always take our umbrella. And Sarah, does the umbrella always stay up or does it fly away? It'll stay up. Mm hmm. And Hold on, mommy's turn to talk. All right, so our umbrellas normally fly away because we have these little, let me show you what, this is how thin our umbrella pole is. We don't have big fancy umbrellas because let's be honest, that stuff's expensive and they don't last that long. So we have these basic ones from, you know, just the small ones that you can get at Target or Walmart. Um, and and my dad's going to buy Hungry Young Rainbow. My turn. All right, so when we got this product, um, when we took our normal umbrella, it would get knocked over all the time by the wind. It just didn't last. So what we needed, what we needed was, what we needed was this thing right here. Um, please stop or I'm going to put you down. Okay. All right. Anyways, um, this thing is awesome. It saves us. It is heavy freaking duty. Can you feel it, Sarah? Is it so light? Gonna... Is it light or is it heavy? Heavy. It's heavy. She and can... we're gonna try it on the ground. Should we show you right now? <laughs> All right. Let me show you. Should we show them the inside? Okay. So that's how big the diameter is. There's plenty of room depending on um, what size umbrella you have. I thought mine might be a little too small for it, and I was a little nervous. And but... I always wanted it as a Sarah. umbrella for me. Okay. Anyways. Um, this one itself, you'll see, it actually, put it over there so you can see it. It really does, thank you. Um, it adjusts to all different sizes. So even this little thin one, this lovely little adjuster right here, um, makes it able to fit any size umbrella. Now I would be careful that you don't push it too hard because I kind of indented our umbrella. I don't know if you could see that because I pushed it a little too hard. So my bad, but here is the inside and it, it really, it locks up really smoothly and easily, but this thing is awesome. It stays in the sand. It keeps your umbrella in its place and keeps us happy campers. Right, Sarah? Yeah. So are we happy with this one? Be careful. Are we happy with this one? Yeah. All right. So hope you enjoyed it. Um, I would definitely think of investing in something like this. If you go to the beach a lot, it's worth it. And it's really not that heavy. She says it's heavy. She's a big fat liar. It's a uh, lightweight well, plastic. It's light. Well, it's not heavy. I tricked it. You tricked it. Um, anyways, Ooh. it's a light plastic and it's good. One last thing I forgot to mention. It has these little hand grips to make it easier to twist when getting it in the sand. All right, so that's it for me, and that's it for Sarah. Can you say bye? Bye.